Avengers Infinity War has literally just come out, and you went to see it today. I did, I went to see it in IMAX 3D. It was most wonderful. Was it? <laughs> it was so good. Um, I kind of, that's the review then, isn't it, really? <laughs> that's all you need to say. But, yeah, I mean, if you're invested in the Marvel Universe in any way for the last ten years, uh, it pretty much gives you everything that you've been waiting for, really, I think. If you're not, then not so much. <laughs> but, um, no, it was just, yeah... You know, it's not perfect. Um, I'm not gonna. I'm tr- gonna try not to spoil it. I mean, if I were you and you haven't seen it, I wouldn't watch any videos because anything might give you know even the slightest thing away. I would just leave it. So, you know, maybe I'll go over the couple of problems I had with it. I think there wasn't enough Hulk, but um, he was in Thor Ragnarok quite a lot, so maybe that's why. Black Widow again is underused as she is most of the time, which is a bit of a shame, and. Um, well, that's it, really. I think <laughs> so much. Else. Some of the CGI is a bit dodgy, but most of it is, you know, is state of the art stuff. But yeah, I mean, if you, like I say, if you're invested in this, you know, cinematic universe in any way, um, then it, it, I, I felt it delivered, you know, on, on everything that it's been building to ever, you know, ever since Iron Man came out ten years ago. Is this a sequel? Well, it's well, it's kind of a sequel to every Marvel film that has that has come before it. Effectively, but there's been another Avengers. There has been two Avengers films, yeah. One was in 2012, I think. The other one is a couple of years, I think, 2014 or 15. Right. You know, okay. they've all and they've all had strands that was kind of linked to this. If you're expecting everybody to meet up in, at the same time on the screen, then you're going to be disappointed because they don't. They're off in different strands. Um, you know, and there are a few things going on at the same time, but I think it, it all comes together and there's nothing, you're never confused about what's going on. You know, I think it's well paced, even though, you know, even though it's quite long. It never felt slow. And not every hero is in it either. I mean, a lot of people noticed that Hawkeye wasn't on the poster. He's not in the film either. Who's Hawkeye? <laughs> He's the guy with the bow and arrow. <laughs> right. But if you haven't seen, like, the first Thor no. or either of the Avengers films, nope. then you won't know who he is. And Ant-Man isn't in it either, which is a bit strange. And there's, like, a throwaway line about uh, why they're not in it, which is over very briefly. And I don't, I don't really know the real reason why they're not in it. Um... But yeah, that was slightly disappointing. I thought maybe there was going to be some big reveal and they were going to appear at, at, you know, at the last minute or something, but no, they don't. Uh, which obviously is a spoiler, so... <laughs> Again, sorry. Um, and it, you know, it does end with a cliffhanger as well. There, you know, there is another Avengers film next year. I think at one point there was going to be Infinity War Part 1 and 2, but I don't think that's the case anymore. I'm not sure what the next one's called, but it, does, <laughs> it doesn't... You know, it, it's a bit of an Empire Strikes Back ending, I suppose. Right. Um, so we've got to wait for the next one now. So, um, so do you recommend people go and see it? I definitely do, yes. Do you recommend I go and see it? No. <laughs> I think if you haven't seen any of them, I don't there's too much that you just wouldn't know what the hell these people are. Uh, what they, you know, because there's no need, they don't really need to set anything up, which is why you know it, it, the pacing is good because there's no protracted opening where you know they have to in- introduce lots of characters because you know anyone who's watched all the movies so far will know who all these people are. Right. So I would I would like to see it because worth it. because the trailer looks good. Yeah, I just realised yeah. I'm going to have to watch all. Of well, yes, I think you know I don't think you'd the have last to see... one, the last Marvel film, I think I well, we saw Spider Man. Spider Man, but yeah. I did enjoy Ant Man. Mm. But you say he's not in it. He's not in it, unfortunately. So... No, there's some, you know there's some great scenes where you know where these characters meet for the first time and interact. Uh, you know when Iron Man meets up with them and all this, and it yeah it's it's. Um... It's really good, you know. It's just it's just great to see them all on screen at once because it's been building for so long. And you saw it in the IMAX. I just see it in so IMAX. It was very yeah. big. It was very big. Very yeah. loud. It was very loud. <laughs> but no, I think it was. If not all filmed on IMAX, most of it was. And it, you know, it is great. You know, so the whole thing fills the whole screen for the whole film. There's no sort of changing ratios or anything like that. So it looks great. So if you can see it in IMAX, I would, you know, I would recommend it. I saw it in 3D as well, and that was really good. So um, yeah, if you can. Check it out there. So that was a short chat on Infinity Wars, Avengers, yeah. the new Avengers movie. Yeah. We Check thought we thought we'd just do a quick little review, bite size review, bite size review. Yeah, um, just to you know, obviously you might like those films or you might not, like me, uh, which is fine. If you don't, you probably won't even be watching this. So you won't about <laughs> exactly. Uh, so yeah, but you know, if you've gone to see it today or if you're going to see it, you know, you're welcome to come back and let us know what you thought of it. I. But I don't care really, but he does. So I don't care. I loved it, so I don't really care what anyone else thinks. That's great. But uh, yeah, do that. And other than that, um, we'll be back for a longer film chat in a couple of days yeah. tomorrow. Actually, because it's Thursday today. Yes. So we'll see you tomorrow.